Good morning, it's Tuesday, October 6th, and this is your HuffPost Morning News Brief. A major victory for President Obama and his economic agenda as the U.S., Japan, and 10 other countries have approved the Trans-Pacific Partnership, which aims to lower trade barriers and set commercial rules for about 40 percent of the global economy. Many provisions are the subject of deep skepticism and outright opposition from voices across the spectrum. And getting it approved by Congress during an election year is no small matter. President Obama will travel to Oregon Friday to meet privately with families of those shot last week at a community college. Meanwhile, voices for stronger gun control measures are growing louder. Smarter gun laws in this country are long overdue. The lives of innocent men and women and babies and children are at stake. How many more? Floodwaters are receding in Columbia, South Carolina, now leaving behind massive damage. After four days of searching, the Coast Guard now believes a cargo ship carrying 33 people, including 28 Americans, sank to the bottom of the sea in that ferocious category for Hurricane Joaquin. It was a tight squeeze as a Tonight Show featured the telephone booth quiz game with Hugh Jackman, Shaquille O'Neal, Alex Trebek, and more. Pressing against my chest. Yeah. I hope it's his belly button. No, <laughs> it is his belly button as an Audi. He wrote help on the glass. <laughs> Congratulations, you guys! That means Hugh Jackman is the winner! That's the news you need to know. Consider yourself briefed.